Hello and welcome to Nitchcast. This is the Mad Pack and this is my sixth episode here. And what we did last time was we built this beautiful little, uh, well not exactly beautiful, but a nice little tower here to uh, store all of our items in. So we'll have our books and everything in there and whatnot and all the others. Um, and that's basically what we did last time. Uh, what I plan on doing this time is, well, I've got nothing on me, so I am going to actually go and loot that little uh, building right next to us. Um, but before I do that, I, I want to go sleep. So I'll just go sleep right now. And, uh... Oh, that's a nice cup of tea, guys. Um, and... We'll go out and we'll go and, uh, collect these resources inside this building in um, <clears throat> yeah we have our furnace room I do want to make a grinder so how do we make a grinder uh, we need some flint which I believe I've got some of a four shine block so I need to start with my force actually so I'll I'll do that now so I'll take a force, a couple of force gems. Uh, have I got silver? I've got silver ore here. And I'll just uh, pop a couple in one of these. In fact, I'll do eight. In fact, I'll just leave them all in, and I'll just whack one piece of coal in there, and then whatever it does, it does. Um, and I'll just pop the rest of my coal in here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn these silver ingots into force ingots, which I'll get a force nugget off. Well, I'll get nine off one, unless that's one. No. Um, and then I'm going to make a, a force rod, uh, which is part of dark craft. And then um, which with your standard force rod, you only get three uses. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna. I need one more use your standard force rod for your first three saplings um, and then after that you can upgrade to like the other force um, rod which has a lot more uses basically um, so to do this you just literally put your um, what are they called now your power, your force gems uh, if you use your silver you get three force ingots for every two silver which is why I'm using silver because you get more if you use iron you get two back which isn't really that great um, so I'll just do that get some force nuggets put one there um, I've got some wood on me so I'll just make a stick quickly and I'll leave them in there actually I'll, I'll go up and grab the other lot and I think it's like that yeah and basically you only have three uses with this so I'm just going to run up and grab some saplings which are in here um, I'm not sure if you could do it with your jungle saplings I'll try it with my jungle um, because that's all I've got like I've only ever done it with oak wood and spruce wood saplings before so I'll just plant one there and shabam we have a four sapling so I'll just uh, make the most of this uh, force rod and just use it up because you only get three uses uh, and then I will get a four shard um, I'm not sure what you use a four shard for at the moment um, I will find out later for y'all. Um, oh, actually, I need to change my signs because that's not wood no more. This one's now wood. Ah, I don't want to do that. And I'll just put the rest of my signs in here. And. I'll put my force shard in my valuables because I'm not sure what you do with it. Like I know you get that every time you break a force rod, um, so it is pretty useful. 
Um, if I find my... What am I looking for now? I'm looking for some bones, actually. So, not on this floor, but on the floor above. Which is in bits and bobs. And I'll just turn this into um, some bone meal. And then I'll grow my um, golden saplings. Well, my four saplings. Um, and then, happy days. I shall grow you like a babe. And grow you like a babe. And grow you like a babe. So, we now have some forest trees. Just collect them force saplings. I also got some force nuggets which you obtain through breaking them and whatnot. Here um, I'll just break the trees down and then I'll make some force sticks with the force wood. Um, <clears throat> and then I'll be able to make a better force rod which will last a lot longer and there's many uses for a force rod. Um, so like if you find some armor and you don't want it you can just literally use your force rod click on it happy days you get your materials apart from one um, and I've noticed actually that sometimes if you use your iron like if you use your iron helmet a little bit you can still use it on your iron helmet although it's been used and you still get four back I think so I'm not 100% sure so don't take my word for it um, as for I am new to this mad pack um, so we have our force logs so what we'll do with that is make some force planks and then we'll make some force sticks put one in the middle get another one of these force nuggets and a force ingot and there we go we have a full force rod um, and what I'm going to do is I am just going to plant some of my force saplings about I'm not actually going to bother with growing them because we can grow in their own time now I've got enough for the time being so I'll just uh, plant four like so that'll do and when they grow I'll take them and whatnot. Um also if uh, like I'm on about the meteorites if you uh, create armor with it you get magnetization one on your armor as well which is very handy for when you um, want to carry things around with you uh, well especially when you're full if you like if you can't carry nothing else with you then or you can't use it on that if you're carrying too much with you so if you're full um, it will actually magnetize it and it'll keep on rotating around you until you like get rid of some of your stuff out of your inventory and then that way you're not going to leave anything behind I'm not sure how good it is um, in terms of magnetizing and bringing it with you because I've only used it with full armor. Um, so now that we've got our force force uh, trees and everything, we need to make our um, grinder. So if we just go on to here and how to make one of these, we need a force hammer. So we need two sticks and some iron ingots. Um, I'm pretty sure there is another force hammer, which is this one which using force ingots so I'll tell you what I'm gonna make one using force ingots because it'll be a lot cooler if I did um, and I'll just grab a couple more of these and then I can make one out of force and have a stronger one which lasts a lot longer put two there, two there and I'll take them, nine um, just so you know you can actually make stuff out of your force stuff as well uh, so um, yeah and what do I need to make it out of again um, press E and yeah so I need some more force in got um, how many do I need though that's the question I need eight so if I Oh, actually, I've got some nuggets on me now, so what I'll do is I'll change these nuggets into, well, I've only got one force in, got, which is the one which I originally changed, and I've got two left over. So I have gained from them saplings already, um, so I need another three of them. So 
what we're going to do is we're going to get a couple more pieces of silver so I'll just bang another piece of coal in there and we'll have another piece of uh, some more silver we only need three more so I'll just uh, wait for this to do two and then that should be enough uh, force we love the force may the force be with you so uh, yeah we need another one of these and then we can change them into force ingots now we have eight so if I do that and put that to the side make eight of them put them around like so we've got our force chine block uh, so there's step one so if I just click on that again so we need two cobblestone three flint and we need one of these so we need copper cable um, have I actually got any resin or anything um, silicon what can you use that for you can turn that into redstone no um, so I've started making that and I haven't even got the, all the ingredients for it so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to call this an episode um, and next episode we shall find go and hunt for a rubber tree um, hopefully we'll find one nearby unless I have already got a rubber sapling have I? got a rubber sapling um, I don't think I do I have a witchwood sapling and that's all um, so yeah we'll have to leave it for this episode and I'll see you next episode thank you all for watching and I hope you all enjoyed it if you did then don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe it'll help me out a stack and well yeah I'll see you next time thank you and bye